Okay, exciting news. A couple days later, I found a coffee table. Well, actually, Chris found it for me, but same thing. And we're gonna go pick it up. It is a little defective. There's a little piece of the wood on the edge missing, but he swears he can fix it and who am I to question? I also am trying to sell my current coffee table. Like I just want it gone because I don't want to have two tables in my apartment. So I'm really hoping this lady can come pick it up today. We're also gonna have to paint it a little bit, but I love a good DIY. I don't mind it at all. We'll see you when we have the table. Y'all should have seen the teamwork that just happened. Getting this down three flights of stairs. All this orange theory, but you can't touch me. I love it, it's so cute. For reference, here is my old coffee table. I'm phasing out the black and silver, so my new coffee table is rectangular, and I'm gonna get a new carpet and new pillows, of course, to make it match the new vibe. Oh my gosh, I just did my skincare, so I'm like fully glowing. Literally angel, I just got down from heaven. What I came on here to tell you is that the table renovation is happening. It is commencing. So this is what the paint looks like currently. The girl, I'm sure she had this table for a few years. You speak gold. Uh, it's seen some things. So you sanding it down so we can kind of get it all one smoothness. And then I bought some spray paint at Home Depot. It's gold again, but it's more like a softy gold. There's also one minor flaw. A piece of the wood came off right here. So I think Chris is gonna use body filler to try and fix it, but it's super minor. I mean, I don't really care that much, but it would be nice if it got fixed. However, I did get it off Facebook Marketplace for 90 bucks, so no one is complaining. If anyone's complaining, it's not me. I'm very happy. <laughs> okay, the decorating vlog continues. This is like a week and a half later. Oopsies, we're at Home Depot. I'm looking at lights for my bedroom. I need like a flush mount one. But of course, I'm gravitating towards all the ones that are crystally, sparkly. I really like this one. That one is cool, but I don't really love $150. Here's the cart. We have a medicine cabinet in here, plus two things for the bathroom. This is a towel holder, toilet paper thing, and then this is an extra towel bar. Okay, see, I liked this one, but I didn't like this extra satellite dish around it. That's it, for example. But I see this one that doesn't have a satellite dish. However, it is not up here, so I wonder how much it is because I really like that one. Okay, turns out this one is only $89, so we're getting it. Now I feel like I should get this sconce for my entryway because it's the exact same design. Then it can be all matchy matchy. Amazing. Okay, grand total is 501, which I don't think is too bad because I got a cabinet, two lights, two bathroom fixture things, a stud binder, and a level. Okay, so here's my front door, and this is the current sconce. This just came with the place. It's marble. I mean, it's nice, but I I'm, I'm looking for glam. Okay, guys, here she is. Be gone. <laughs> We're also gonna change this one and this one. I don't know who smacked their noggin into this, but it's like completely bent. Okay, guys, final product. Both the towel rings up, plus the new toilet paper holder, plus the new towel square. I feel like this makes such a huge difference. Little tiny things. I think both of these were like 70 bucks. I feel like I have a new bathroom. Okay, I'm gonna go eat some Oreo pie. Bye. <laughs> Hello, it's the next day. The renovation, <laughs> renovation, the renovation continues. Not even renovation, that's dramatic. Extreme. <laughs> Where's Ty Pennington? Um, okay, I got a cabinet to go above my toilet. Let me show you the exact one. Hold got it at Home Depot. Very basic, two doors with like a little shelf at the bottom. But my cabinets in my kitchen are this pretty blue color and so are the cabinets in my bathroom. So we figured why not paint this new thing the same blue so that it kind of ties in. Cause my bathroom is like separate from where my vanity area is. So having like a little blue in the bathroom area too and the blue on the cabinets in the vanity, like that would, that would be cute. You see what I'm saying? Um, I have this little scuffy, I'm gonna take this little scuffy pad thingy and do this little number because then this will help the paint adhere more. Then after that, we're gonna paint it blue. My landlord left the paint like in the closet thing, so it's the exact color. While we're doing it, we are watching the Murdoch Murders series on HBO. We already watched the one on Netflix. 
We're heading to HBO now. Very good, I highly recommend. So let's get to it. So this is the current light in my bedroom. These little things were broken off when I came. So it's a little older, uh, a little antique-y. We're gonna replace it with this one I got at Home Depot yesterday. I think this will look phenomenal. Oh wait, is this it? No, this is part of it. Okay, anyways, you get the point. All right, here's the before. This came with the place. It's gold, and some of the pieces were actually starting to fall off those crystal dangly bits, so we switched it over to a silver, also crystal on this one, but a totally different vibe. This is very glam. It's exactly what I want. Okay, cue the Home Depot song. <laughs> like what, four hours later, we're finally painting it. <laughs> I get so sidetracked. The last time I saw you, I was sanding. That was around two. It is nearly eight. That's my best talent actually, is getting not shit done. Here is the cabinet. Here is the roller. <laughs> is this right? I'm doing this. Is it okay to just start in the middle? Shouldn't? Oh. I want a paint card or a paint roller. <laughs> yeah, that looks good to me. Woo! Just a woman in her roller. so hard being the only one who works around here. I have advice for women in business. Get off your ass and work. No one wants to fucking work these days. <laughs> Did you not see that interview with Kim Kardashian? No. <laughs> her and her whole family were doing like an interview for some, I don't know. And they were like, what advice do you have for women in business? I have the best advice for women in business. Get your fucking ass up and work. It seems like nobody wants to work these days. But it's just hilarious because it's like, okay, easy for you to say, Kim. Yeah, with her 14 assistants. <laughs> Okay, here's what it looks like so far. Chris rigged up my blow dryer so we can let this dry faster, but it looks pretty good, right? Now I have to do the doors. Update, I just dipped my hair in the paint. I knew that was gonna happen. I just had a feeling. Dish soap. Oh my god, it's blue! My hair is blue! <laughs> it's blue! I have blue hair! I'm getting married in a week! Congratulations. Okay, I think I got it out. Emergency surgery, everything was successful. It actually did all come out. So if you ever dip your hair um, in paint, dish soap. Let me show you exactly how it happened. I was <laughs> leaning like this and just dipped the whole the whole thing in. Speaking of nobody want to work these days, I just ordered Domino's and they called me within like five seconds and said, we don't have any drivers. Do you want to come pick it up? Nobody wants to work. Get off your ass and work. <laughs> it's fine. I guess that makes me have to not be lazy. I'm going to go pick it up. Part of me want to be like, never mind. But then I'm like, that's a little dramatic. You just wanted to tell her, cancel that. <laughs> I know for a fact in your head you were like, um, well, yeah, I guess y'all are going to be coming to Domino's with me. But the cabinet is dry. The doors are dry. And um, my lips are chapped. Really bad. Do yours feel chapped? I think it's just because I've been working so hard, I'm like sweating. That happens, doesn't it? Yeah. Here's a final picture of the cabinet, guys. It turned out perfectly. We switched out the silver knobs for these crystal knobs that I got on Amazon. We also put them on the cabinet in the vanity area so it ties kind of the two areas together. Here's a wide view of the vanity spot. You can see that medicine cabinet is big and she is in charge. I love it. Also, the curtain is not staying with us. It's leaving. Still working on finding a permanent solution, but either way, here is a little tour of the medicine cabinet. I kind of have it in sections, kind of not. The middle area is definitely skincare focused. I have my little gua sha there, bunch of moisturizers, toners, face masks. This area has my setting sprays, also a lot of my serums, and then my tanning stuff and hair serums. I'm obsessed. I literally go everywhere in these Cookie Monster pajamas, and then the second I leave the house, I'm like, wait, I'm kind of embarrassed. <laughs> Bag secured. Shotgun rider. Is that a poodle? This is the setup. Fresh Diet Coke. Just cracked. Ranch. My pizza. Loaded tots from Domino's actually are really good. Even... Let's see. She bad and she knows. 
and I grabbed some hot sauce because I don't really put that on my pizza, but I think it might be good. Okay guys, new day, new project. Today we're tackling the patio. I just went to World Market. Actually, I only spent like 120 bucks, which is pretty good for everything I got. So first, this rug or mat, I guess it's more so, it's like a plasticky. It can go this way or this way. More blue, more white. I think we're gonna do more blue. We have a slight problem, but we're gonna fix it. The railing. Ow, mother fuck, it just shocked me. This bar goes down so the carpet can't go down, but I think we're just gonna cut a baby square out of it, probably. For reference, I got these chairs off of Amazon. They were $98, I think. They come with the cushion, with the table, with tempered glass, and like really nice, hear that? Quality. And pillows. And they're rocking chairs, so I can just sit here and think about all my problems every morning <laughs> and then we also got some more accessories well i did so i'll show you in a second okay cheese it's not included but here are the pillows i was nervous because i'm so bad about mixing patterns but notice that blue is like the same as this blue guys this is adorable okay it is definitely a few weeks later but i have a better patio update the, the sun is kind of setting so perfect time Okay, so we still have the same mat, some potting mix over here. Um, dustpan, need to bring that inside. That's the old mat, I need to throw that away. Okay, anyways, moving on to the new stuff. Oh my god, the fairy lights! You can see they just turned on perfectly, wow. Um, wrap those all around the railing. Also, did lights that kind of string across the front. Oh my god, it's so cozy. These are the chairs. I'm so glad I went with the pink pillows. I don't know if I told you guys, but I returned the other pillows. Didn't love them. These are also from World Market, um, but they're just pink on one side and then like a that. I don't, pff, whatever. I also got this little lantern thing instead from World Market. Amazing. My Amazon chairs still love them. I'm so glad that they're rocking chairs. These little planters, someone told me they're supposed to go on the opposite side whatever we'll get to that when we get to that i'm planning to put a bunch of flowers in there but i won't plant until after the last frost but yeah do y'all love my little patio i'm obsessed with it i don't know what else to add well i guess i'm gonna add more flowers and plants and stuff but i want to hang like a something that makes nice noises what is that wind chime yeah, sure. Okay. One last update before I end the video. I ordered a chair, a carpet, and wallpaper from Paige. So I should be getting the chair and the carpet soon. I just have to like get a car that can fit them because I don't want to pay for shipping. Anyways, um, those are coming. I also got a piece of art that I'm about to unbox. I literally just got it in the mail. So we'll show that to you as it's, you know, up on the wall. I haven't hung anything yet because I do plan on painting, but guys, it's just a lot of money at once. Because I've gotten questions on TikTok like, when are you doing more videos? It's just a lot of money. Like this video, I spent a lot of money on the patio, plus like the cabinets, plus all the stuff for like the bathroom, the new lights. It's, it's tough doing like a lump sum. So I'm trying to split it up, but I know you guys like want content, but I'm a real girl, okay? This isn't no LA influencer type of vibe. This is real money, real people, real problems. So I'm taking it slow, but I'm also a little impatient, like I kind of want it done. Um, so I think the carpet will change the whole vibe. Once I get the carpet, I'm gonna change up the pillows as well because like I said, I wanted to incorporate more gold and also pink because there's going to be some stuff on the wall that's pink. Okay, I don't want to give too much away. Um, I love you guys. Please subscribe. I hope you enjoyed this compilation of stuff. And thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting. I love you.